Hemming is a basic sewing task when making garments, but there isn't one standard hem that fits all types of fabric. Hemming knits can come with its own issues and solutions. This video offers some tips to make hemming knit easier. While knits are a dream to wear, sewing with them can cause headaches. They can stretch and get wavy, they may get the tunnel effect with double stitching, or the hem doesn't stretch enough. To prep, make sure you use a ballpoint or stretch needle that's appropriate for your fabric weight. If you're worried about stretching the fabric while sewing, you can use a walking foot. If you don't have a walking foot, lower the presser foot pressure dial. If you need help with this, see our video. If you're worried about tunneling, like with a double needle, you should use something to stabilize the fabric, like knit interfacing, wash away stabilizer, or knit stay tape. Iron or attach your choice of stabilizer on the wrong side at the hemline area where you'll be stitching. Knit doesn't unravel, so you only need to fold your hem once and don't need to worry about finishing the raw edges. This will also make your hem area less bulky. Hem with your preferred stitch. If you want a tutorial specific on using the double needle, check out our video on it. Using a stabilizer should lead to less tunneling, especially in lightweight knits. If you have wavy hems, put your iron on a setting that produces steam. Hover the iron about one inch away from your hem and apply steam. This should relax the fabric back into shape and it should lie flatter. Let's go over the best type of stitches for knit. If the hem doesn't need to stretch, you can do a standard straight stitch. If it does need to stretch, you can do a double needle stitch, a zigzag stitch, or a stretch stitch. If you want to do a machine blind hem, use a stretch blind hem stitch that looks like this. Instead of straight stitches in between peaks, it has more of a zigzag stitch to allow for stretching. If you want to do a hand stitch so it'll be even less noticeable, do a catch stitch. You can check out our video on the catch stitch if you need help with this. If you're nervous about hemming knit, use some scrap fabric and practice beforehand. This also allows you to find the correct machine tension. If you're still having trouble with your hem, spray the fabric with spray starch, but only do this if your fabric is washable and you can clean off the spray starch after you finish. Knits aren't the easiest fabric to hem, but it's definitely not impossible, and if you apply these tricks, your garments will come out even more professional looking. We hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified of our new releases. Also check out ProfessorPinkCushion.com to view our complete library with well over 450 sewing tutorials. If you would like to directly support us, you can join our YouTube membership and earn some exclusive perks. Thanks for watching.